Hey guys, so uh, this is the new iOS 9. Um, let me just verify so I can show you guys that it is. So as you can see, it's 9.0. Um, so I like it. Um, it's a lot. It's a lot smoother. Um, the battery life lasts longer. Uh, it looks like Apple got a lot of bugs out of this more uh, current version than uh, iOS 8. iOS 8, we all know, had a little hiccups here and there. Um, so let me just go over some features that it has. Uh, the first feature that I like uh, is in the photos. Um, as you can see here, it has a new selfies and uh, screenshots, which is pretty good. Um, another thing, they have a new app. Uh, well, it's not really new. Uh, the newsstand from before, but now they updated with this new news app, which is pretty cool. Um, you can select what you're interested in so it's going to give you a whole bunch of uh, interested items and stuff like that and you can go through and select everything that you like and then it gives you a news feed uh, so let me just select alright let me select this one and let's select wired uh, let's see what else they have let's select some more basketball and then let's hit continue um, you can set it up so it can go in your inbox. Uh, I'm gonna hit not now, um, but as you can see, these are the new feeds for the, the news articles that I selected, which is pretty cool. Uh, you can go through and check out the latest articles and stuff like that. It'll update on its own. Um, so that's for the news. Uh, something else that they have, and uh, we all know that Apple came out with Apple Music. Uh, if you go here, you could sign up for it. Uh, I, I didn't sign up yet, um, but yeah, that's the new streaming service through uh, JBeats and stuff like that. Uh, another thing that they have uh, in Spotlight now you can search for apps. So like, if I want to do WhatsApp, bam, it comes up, um, which is cool. Uh, another thing that they have in Mail. Um, the gestures just to slide over so now like if you want to read uh, mark it as red you just slide over right or if you want to either move or flag or trash it you slide over left so that's a new feature that they have within the mail application um, also they change when you double tap to see what current apps are running they made like these card things now so now you can go in and remove whatever apps you want by going up and just deleting them that way um, that, that also helps out the RAM and things like that uh, what else do they have here uh, so also if you go to settings and we go back and we go to restrictions now they have new restrictions for like the newsletter and things of that nature um, like just basic stuff that you don't want to happen you'll do that in your restrictions area so, um, like I said before, it's pretty smooth. Um, last thing I want to talk about is probably the maps. I heard that they uh, update the maps with the sorry map that they had last time that always kept crashing and then was inaccurate. Now it's more updated. Um, it runs a lot smoother too. Um, it's pretty cool. You can do your directions and everything. I've tried it once and uh, it was pretty successful. I haven't gotten more into detail with it yet, but um, you could try it out to see if that works for you. But uh, yeah, so those are like the some of the features that it has. Um, I'm pretty sure I covered most of it. If not, uh, you can leave your comments below. I'll comment on it. But uh, thanks for watching. You guys have a good one. Thank you.